John Dyche will make his debut as Everton boss this weekend. He may have been hoping for some reinforcements in yeah. the transfer window, but Jules, he got none. Nothing. Though maybe Andre Ayew on his... Yeah, I mean, I don't even want to hear Andre Ayew's name being linked with Everton because that would be absolutely crazy at 33 who've been playing in Qatar for the last two or three years. I mean, Andre Ayew cannot help Everton right now. They should have spent some of the money that they got from... Anthony Gordon, for example, or something. They try Olivier Giroud. I mean, why? Why would you think that Olivier Giroud would swap Milan, right? Where he's still in the Champions League, where he can still technically win the league, where he won last season. He's scoring goals. He just played the World Cup final. To go to Everton right now and fight against relegation and be in the Championship next season? I, uh, who does that recruitment? Who has those ideas? I would love to know. I didn't know. I did not know about the Giroud yeah. thing. But what I find shocking is... I, and I know they've been through, is it uh, Thelwell is now the director of football? I think so, yeah. I'm going to assume he doesn't watch much um, Serie A or listen to our show because if he did, he would know that it right works. now Giroud's at to play like every game for Milan yeah. because Ibrahimovic is out, because Rafael out through the middle doesn't work, because Rabic has been injured. So Milan can't let Giroud go right yeah. now, even if they would want to, because Milan, I thought like they're going to go and sign another center forward, right? Yeah. Exactly. Um, so I'm just thinking to myself, why are you wasting your time with this? I'm, look, Sean Dyche just came in. They did not have a lot of time to go and plan this. But goodness me. By the way, if you're wondering why Andre Ayu can sign, uh, even though the transfer window is closed, it's uh, because he's a free agent. Yeah. He's a free agent. Yeah. Thanks so much for watching ESPN on YouTube. And for more sports highlights and analysis, be sure to download the ESPN app. And for premium content and live streaming, subscribe to ESPN+.